There's also a basket here, too. Hi, I'm Susan Bronstein, and today we were fortunate enough to receive delivery of donations from Pasco Hernando, as well as donations that were brought over from Palm Beach and Miami-Dade College. There were many organizations that wanted to help, um, and as they asked what we needed, we gave them a list of things that we thought we would use. Anything from baby supplies to toiletries to paper products and food. And our sister colleges within the Florida College System jumped right in and very quickly sent supplies over that we were then able to organize through a distribution center, originally on the Lee campus. So we're all the way from Miami-Dade College. Um, different campuses came together. We have Kendall and Hialeah here, but all SGAs, a part of the entire college, came together for the community. We came to Fort Myers and we were dropping off a bunch of supplies. It was a truck load of it. The truck that came in from Miami-Dade was a box truck that was packed. I don't think there was a single inch that was available in that truck. We're not the only ones who've been through hurricanes. You guys have been through hurricanes. Other states have been through hurricanes. This is our opportunity to help you guys like you guys have helped us many times in the past. We all care about each other. We're all one state. We're all one nation. Right. It's important to give back to one another. Today we are receiving emergency supplies and relief supplies that my son, Paul Bartunik, who works for ABB in Kansas City, and he partnered with Sims Global to get the semi-truck and load it with water, paper towels, snacks, generators, and many other emergency supplies to help Southwest Florida. That's a long way from here, so to get that kind of a response from Kansas City is just heartwarming to all of us who are here receiving it. I got the email, I'm a student here, and I was impacted by the hurricane, so um, it was hard to get supplies and stuff for the baby since everything was off shelf. So you guys are helping out with all of the donations. So we came in to pick up some items for myself and the baby. Everyone was leaving with Thank you so much. God bless you. This is amazing. Thank you so much. I mean, there was a palpable sense of blessing in, in the whole organization because people really felt like someone cared and they were, we were there to provide for them. I live on an island that it directly hit, so it's kind of inaccessible and all the houses are destroyed and everything. And we literally have nothing left. People looted our house and everything. We lost all our food, all our bath supplies, everything like that. So I'm like really happy that everyone's coming together and donating all this stuff for people who need it. Thank you to everybody who's donated and to the school for putting it together. It means a lot. To have these people to take out time, uh, maybe from their families and whatever they were going through to come and help others, that's amazing. Some families are without and to be able to come here and basically pick out anything we need, um, it means everything to us.